Good morning. This is your AI host, Jay. I'm here with the automatically generated Jernita morning headlines on April 9, 2022. Russia heading for worst recession since end of Cold War, says UK. The Guardian, Russia heading for deepest recession since Soviet Union collapse, UK says. Reuters.com, Russia heading for deepest recession since Soviet collapse, UK warns, as inflation jumps, as it happened. Woman who drew up Schindler's list during Holocaust dies at 107. Russia-Ukraine war latest, Zelensky calls for, firm, global response to, war crime, at Kramatorsk train station, live. Abramovich linked yacht in Netherlands changed hands on day of Ukraine invasion. The Guardian, unsanctioned Abramovich partners have £100 million in British assets. The Times, from Marlebon to Caribbean, wealth of Abramovich's business partners revealed. German government drops plan for Covid vaccine mandate. The Guardian, Germany mulls bringing back masks this autumn. The independent, mandatory vaccines for over 60s rejected by German parliament. The Telegraph, Olaf Scholz defeated over plan for mandatory Covid vaccines in Germany. Financial Times, failed German Covid vaccine mandate means no further easing of curbs, health minister says. Germany will stop importing Russian gas, very soon, says Olaf Scholz. The Guardian, Germany could end Russian oil imports this year, Scholz. Reuters.com, Germany rules out ban on Russian gas imports. The Irish Times, Germany must wean itself off Russian gas sooner, not later. Bloomberg, how Germany's approach to Russia backfired. Over 300 villages near Kyiv trapped in basement for weeks, say residents. The Guardian, sharing space with the dead, horror outside Chernihiv, Ukraine, BBC News. BBC News, one tied myself to a post to sleep. Basement prison discovered where 100 people were kept for a month. The Telegraph, Russian soldiers forced families to live in basement with dead bodies. The Times, faces of Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Kramatorsk station attack kills at least 50 fleeing civilians. The Independent, UK's Johnson calls attacks in Ukraine a systematic slaughter. Reuters UK, Ukraine News Live, there are so few of us, Russian soldiers complain in intercepted radio message. Sky News, Ukraine, actions of Russian troops in Buk are not far short of genocide, says Boris Johnson. The Independent, Ukraine War, Buk are deaths not far short of genocide, PM. Global food prices rise to highest ever levels after Russian invasion. The Guardian, world food prices hit new record on impact from Ukraine war. Financial Times, food prices soar to record levels on Ukraine war disruptions. The Independent, world food prices hit record high amid Ukraine war. Politico Europe, food prices hit record high in March, UN agency says. Ursula von der Leyen offers speedy response to Ukraine's bid to join EU. The Guardian, first stage of Ukraine's EU membership to begin within weeks, Ursula von der Leyen says. The Telegraph, von der Leyen on Putin, he has to fail. Politico Europe, unthinkable, Ursula von der Leyen shown mass grave in Bucca. Guardian News, Ursula von der Leyen brands Kramtorsk train station attack despicable as she arrives in Kyiv. Desperation amid food shortages in Shanghai as Covid lockdown bites. The Guardian, millions face food shortages as China continues zero Covid policy. ITV News, Shanghai residents warned about online posts over Covid lockdown. Financial Times, Shanghai, Guangzhou plan more mass tests as Covid cases rise. Bloomberg, Shanghai residents running out of food in Covid lockdown. Video shows aftermath of plane that crashed and broke in half as emergency cockpit audio released. The Independent, DHL cargo jet snaps in two after skidding off runway during emergency landing. Sky News, incredible escape, DHL plane crashes, skids off runway in Costa Rica. Guardian News, watch, plane skids off runway and splits in two during crash landing. The Telegraph, plane splits in two during dramatic landing at Costa Rica airport. Russia-Ukraine war, what we know on day 45 of the invasion. The Guardian, it's proper war but the Russians are running scared, British armed forces veterans in Ukraine. 
iNews, Ukraine Afternoon Briefing, five developments is 90% of Bucca dead had bullet wounds. The Telegraph, Russia-Ukraine war, what we know on day 44 of the invasion. The Guardian, abandoned weapons suggest Russian troops may have fled northern Ukraine in a rush. Katanji Brown Jackson News, live, judge says, we've made it, as Biden slams GOP, verbal abuse during hearing. The Independent, mood as light as spring air as Katanji Brown Jackson delivers words to remember. The Guardian, cheers for Jackson as Biden declares moment of real change. The National, why it might be a long, long time before the Democrats have another black woman senator. The Independent, opinion, KBJ's confirmation fight shows how the Supreme Court must change. Two acquitted and mistrial declared for two others in Whitmer kidnap plot trial. The Guardian, Gretchen Whitmer, Michigan governor kidnap plot case collapses. BBC.com, Whitmer kidnap plot, two men acquitted, hung jury for two more. France elections, Macron's lead over Le Pen narrowing as vote nears. The Guardian, French election, far-right Le Pen closes in on Macron, BBC Newsnight. BBC News, Macron's presidency has been a lamentable failure. The Telegraph, will the French elections reveal a shift to the right, Mary Dejewski. The Independent, who might upset Macron's bid for a second term in office. This was all for the news. Thanks for listening. Please do not forget to like and subscribe.